and thank you for joining us today to talk about book ideas that fit with the 2021 CSLP theme, Tales and Tales, Animals and Stories. I'm Rachel Zegzwert, Vice President of Marketing at Learner Publishing Group, and I'm excited to be presenting our summer reading title suggestions to you today. You can visit our summer reading landing page for complete title lists and webinars for both the CSLP and iReads summer reading programs. The Collaborative Summer Library Program is a consortium of states working together to provide high quality summer reading program materials for children, teens, and adults at the lowest cost possible for their public libraries. Since 1987, program leaders have selected a reading theme and provided promotional and programming materials for summer reading activities for member public libraries. This year's theme for all grade levels is Tales and Tales, Animals and Stories. The CSLP website has resource guides that include reading lists for all grade levels, along with websites, activities, and promotional suggestions. Today, we'll be looking at some of learners' titles that tie into this animal-oriented theme. The solidly non-fiction Bumba Books series, Fantastic Creatures, looks at mythological creatures that kids love, like dragons, unicorns, and mermaids. Through carefully leveled text and critical thinking questions, we share information about the various origin stories behind these beloved and legendary creatures. Did you know that dogs can learn to count or that an octopus is able to solve a maze? This series introduces primary grades readers to different kinds of intelligent animals and the amazing things they can learn to do. The colorful layouts and bright photos of super smart animals books are sure to draw in readers in grades one to three. Dog lovers won't be able to resist this next series from our Lightning Bolts brand, Who's a Good Dog? Filled with adorable photos of cute canines, these informative titles cover each breed's physical traits and behaviors and let readers know how to care for their furry friends. This series covers the most popular dog breeds, German Shepherds, Golden Retrievers, Labrador Retrievers, Pembroke Welsh Corgis, Pugs, Yorkshire Terriers, Beagles, Boxers, Bulldogs, Dachshunds, and Pitbulls. Do you know which animal has the longest migration of any other? It's the Arctic Tern. These amazing birds mate and raise their young in the Arctic Circle in May. Then in August or September, they fly about 22,000 miles south to Antarctica's feeding grounds, only to head north again in April. With the Lightning Bolt Books Amazing Migrator series, young readers can follow the journeys of six fascinating animals, from tiny dragonflies to giant whales. Colorful photos and clear, lively text explain the life cycle, migratory patterns, and threats facing each animal. Cute animals are everywhere on the internet. In Internet Animal Stars, learn about the lives of dogs, cats, otters, and other creatures when they aren't starring in hilarious online videos. These guides to popular internet creatures showcase each animal's life cycle, diet, and more, alongside fun graphics inspired by social media. We include profiles of internet famous animals such as Grumpy Cat and a meme break feature at the end of each book. Scan QR codes throughout the book to watch short videos of each adorable animal. From puke and poop to blood and guts, animals will eat almost anything. Delve into some of the most disgusting meals in the animal kingdom and learn about the creatures that live off of these unusual diets. Full color photos and fascinating facts will keep readers turning the pages to learn more gross details. While eating gross things might be a kind of superpower, the next series in our Searchlight Books brand examines all animal superpowers, focusing on animals with amazing skills in communication, defensive maneuvers, hibernation, migration, predatory strategies, and camouflage. For example, in Exploding Ants and Other Amazing Defenses, readers will meet Malaysian carpenter ants that defend their colony by exploding with poisonous slime that covers and often kills its attackers. The book also features other extreme defenders, such as slimy hagfish, armored and stinky pangolins, and blood-squirting horned lizards. This series is sure to capture readers who thrive on extreme animal tales. Learn fascinating details about insect and arachnid life cycles and see them as you've never seen them before in Creepy Crawlers in Action. Each book includes three augmented reality experiences showing everything from how mosquitoes pierce a human skin to the various parts of a praying mantis's body. Using the free Learner AR app for iPhone or Android, users scan images from the book to access these enhancements. Let's take a look at this jumping spider's mating dance so you can get a sense of it. Cool, right? Now on to some single titles. 
Take a fun look at the surprising variety of ways that animals adorn themselves, from a crab that wears a hat made from a sponge, to a flamingo that oils its feathers, to a lacewing larva that covers itself with debris to hide from predators. Back matter includes additional facts about the featured animals, as well as a glossary and further reading section. In I See Seafood, readers will meet some of the wackiest creatures under the sea, creatures that look like food, through eye-catching photos and engaging text. This funny, informative book introduces readers to the egg yolk jellyfish, the lettuce sea slug, the chocolate chip sea star, and many more delicious, I mean interesting animals. Accessible text and engaging photos make this a very fun read. Next, we have Wait, Rest, Pause, Dormancy in Nature. Captivating photos of animals accompany simple, engaging text that explains dormancy in nature, which is a state of using minimal energy during weather extremes or seasonal changes. Dormancy states can last a few hours or many months. Back Matter provides more detail for older readers. Featuring creatures like ladybugs, chickadees, squirrels, and even alligators, this book definitely won't put curious kids to sleep. Can something small matter at all? Of course it can. In this book for young readers who know a thing about being small, you can take a super close look at details too little to be seen with the human eye. Powerful shots from scanning electron microscopes show shark skin, bird feathers, the hairs on a honeybee's eye, and so much more, proving that tiny details can make a big difference. A fun science book that introduces animals and places around the world that happen to be exactly opposite each other on the globe, with pages that literally have to be turned upside down. What is an antipode? If you dig through the earth directly below, where would you wind up? Vibrant art and clear language make the science of geography, the seasons, and day and night easy to understand. The animals that live in these diverse places on earth make the science accessible and appealing to young readers. This is a book to read and savor over and over again. What kinds of animals live in the different environments earth supports? This book shows how animals, birds, and fish all have a distinctive place to thrive, creating homes even in unexpected places. In this epistolary picture book, Agnes has a beak that can crush bones and arms and stretch wide as a car, but that doesn't make her a monster. After she comes across a postcard, Agnes, a giant Pacific octopus, strikes up a correspondence with various other creatures below and above the waves. Readers will delight in this unlikely introduction to the octopus life cycle. In her trademark rhyming style, author Laura Purdy Salas tells you all about how animals survive chilly weather. Some, such as mice, foxes, and moose, simply tolerate the cold. Of course, black bears hibernate, but chipmunks, wood frogs, and garter snakes do too. And then there are the creatures that migrate, including hummingbirds, blue whales, and even earthworms. Detailed back matter explains more about their survival strategies in this wonderfully illustrated look at animals in winter. See what all the buzz is about in this fresh, fun look at insect anatomy. In the pages of this book, you'll find a workshop filled with everything you need, including a head, a thorax, an abdomen, and much more. Follow along with the imaginative main character as they explore the various parts of insects. Back matter includes a large labeled diagram and a hands-on activity for building your own insect. Long snouts, bright red lips, pointy heads, the animal kingdom is full of critters with unique features. Learn about the incredible adaptations that help these creatures and their odd bods survive and thrive all around the globe. Celebrate the unusual features that make these animals so distinctive with a very close up look. Back matter includes additional odd facts and a map showing where each of the animals lives. This great STEM title brings together biology and engineering through the stories of five different animals around the globe who are thriving thanks to their prosthetic body parts. There's Lola, a sea turtle, Moshe, an Asian elephant, Cassidy, a German shepherd, Vittoria, a gray leg goose, and Pirate, a Berkshire Tamworth pig. Each of these animals was struggling, but through a variety of techniques and technologies, humans created devices that enabled the animals to live and move more comfortably. Discover the stories of how veterinarians, doctors, and students from around the world used 3D printing and other techniques to build bionic body parts for these amazing animals. In the history of life on this planet, 99.9% .9 of all species have gone extinct, but a few have survived almost unchanged. Author Rebecca E. Hirsch introduces readers to six living fossils, including the chambered nautilus shown on the cover, the horseshoe crab with its sticky blue blood, 
and venomous platypuses that sting, as well as a comprehensive explanation of evolution and extinction for readers who may not be familiar with the terms yet. Readers will also discover a spectacular timeline of the history of animal life on Earth. Dive into the stories of these incredible animals and find out how they help scientists piece together evolutionary history. In the last 20 years, the monarch butterfly population has been decreasing. Scientists have marked the decline by monitoring the number of monarchs arriving at their winter migration grounds in Mexico. The Monarchs Are Missing takes readers on a quest to discover what scientists already know and what they're hoping to learn. In addition, the book offers tips about what monarch lovers can do to make a difference, from planting the right plants for a butterfly garden to getting the word out about harmful pesticides and taking part in citizen science projects. What kind of animal would you be if you had eight eyes? Or if your pupils were in the shape of the letter W? Keep an eye out for weird and surprising facts in this playful picture book, which brings together comparative anatomy with a guessing game format. See how your animal eyes are like and unlike those of starfish, spiders, goats, cuttlefish, owls, and slugs. Author Sarah Levine and illustrator T.S. Spookytooth present an insightful view of all that eyes can do. A brand new adventure for the ever resourceful Chico Bonbon bon, monkey with a tool belt, now the star of his own Netflix series. The crisis begins at the Superstar Space Station and Snack Bar. The moon malt machine is broken. Chico and Clark jump aboard their spacecraft, the Banana Five, and blast off to the rescue. Eek, you reek, you make a funk. Where you have been, things stink, stank, stunk. You've left a path, a swath of smell, and yuck, you did it very well. Readers will be delighted by the malodorous melodies in Eek, You Reek, poems about animals that stink, stank, stunk, calling out the different pungent attributes of a full cast of foul-smelling creatures. Award-winning author Jane Yolen and her daughter Heidi Stemple have created a hilarious poetry book about smelly animals. Marilyn Singer explores some heady questions in her book, Hair, Animal Fur, Wool, and More. Why are humans and other mammals covered in hair? And why are there so many different types of it? Readers will find out what hair is, where it comes from, and what the different types are, from the thick fur of a bison to the downy wool of sheep. She also examines how mammals use eyelashes, whiskers, quills, and other kinds of hair to survive. Sandra Merkel's science discovery books are well known for their deep dive into an animal mystery. The most recent title, The Great Bear Rescue, offers a fascinating look at goby bears, the rarest bears on the planet. These adorable animals face threats ranging from illegal gold miners to climate change. Find out more about these bears, which are considered a national treasure in Mongolia, and learn what scientists are doing to help this critically endangered species. There's something for everyone in this 13 book series. Growing Up Gorilla, How a Zoo Baby Brought Her Family Together is a heartwarming true story that chronicles what happened after a mother gorilla gave birth for the first time and then walked away from her newborn baby at Seattle's Woodland Park. The dedicated staff worked tirelessly to find innovative ways for mother and baby to build a relationship. The efforts were ultimately successful as baby Yola bonded with her mother and the rest of the family group. In Death Eaters, author Kelly Milner Halls asks a question sure to intrigue middle grade students. What happens to the bodies of animals and humans after death? Nature's army of death eaters steps in to take care of cleanup. Without these masters of decomposition, our planet would be covered in rotting bodies. This high interest science text looks at the scavengers that help clean up our world. In Eavesdropping on Elephants, Cybert Honor winning author Patricia Newman takes readers behind the scenes to see how scientists are making new discoveries about elephant communication. QR codes in the book connect readers to recordings made by Cornell University's Elephant Listening Project and explains what researchers believe the sounds mean. Did you know that some animals have natural ninja-like talents? Take a look at the unique attributes of geckos, sea urchins, bombardier beetles, and more. For example, geckos can grip almost any surface, including walls and ceilings, with their amazing toes. And when collector urchins are attacked, they release tiny, sharp objects that bear a striking resemblance to throwing stars. You will also meet the scientists who are studying these animals' amazing abilities. In an inlet on the California coast, seagrass grows healthy and strong in the shallow water. This healthy seagrass baffled marine biologist Brent Hughes. The scientist expected this estuary to be overrun with algae, causing the seagrass to die. Why was it thriving? 
As Brent investigated, signs pointed to an unexpected player helping to keep the seagrass healthy, sea otters. What do these top predators have to do with an aquatic grass at the opposite end of the food chain? Brent's amazing discovery gave scientists insight into the delicate balance of ecosystems. Follow science in action as Brent conducts the research that led to this major discovery. Everyone knows that butterflies and frogs go through metamorphosis, but a number of creepy sea creatures do too. In Little Monsters of the Ocean, author Heather Montgomery explores the wacky life cycles of some bizarre ocean animals, like the spiky-headed zoea that somersaults through the water and turns into a shrimpy-looking megalops before finally becoming a blue crab. You'll come to find out that the ocean is swimming with little morphing monsters. Burmese pythons are native to Southeast Asia. So when one showed up dead along the side of a Florida highway in 1979, scientists wondered where it came from. No one knew the snakes had launched a full-scale invasion. Pet pythons that escaped or were released by their owners started breeding in the wild, and these enormous predators began eating every animal in their path. Today, a group of scientists at the Conservancy of Southwest Florida is tracking Burmese pythons to find ways to stop their spread. Page plus links in the book lead to video clips and photos of the scientists working in the field. Delve into the science of pythons and their role as invasive predators. Sharks are in trouble. 50 shark species are at high risk of extinction and another 63 are threatened. Discover the work of scientists and conservationists as they study shark biology and morphology, research migration, feeding, and mating patterns, delve into human, climate, and other threats to shark habitat, and develop sophisticated technologies to aid sharks and shark research. See how scientists also educate the public about real and imagined fear of sharks and encourage citizen participation in shark conservation efforts. In the 21st century, military marine mammals detect lost equipment and underwater mines. Large rats are trained to find landmines in more than 80 countries. Military working dogs search for explosive devices and other weapons and are trained to take down enemy combatants. In earlier centuries, military fighters rode horses into battle, relied on elephants to haul supplies, and trained pigeons to carry messages. Even cats, goats, and chickens have served in wartime as mascots. Learn about the history of animals in warfare, the functions they serve and how they are trained, as well as the psychology that makes animals such good partners in warfare. Meet the science experts who study specimens of extreme longevity in both the plant and animal kingdoms, such as the 80,000 year old root system of Pando, a colony of male quaking aspens, 11,000 year old deep sea sponges, and 400 year old sharks. Learn about the technologies used to determine age and longevity, including DNA sampling, growth rings, and radiocarbon dating. See how scientists located these long-lived species, and why and how they resist disease and aging. And delve into how scientists are using what they know about aged plants and animals to research how we can promote longevity in humans. Quietly, without most people noticing, the population of giraffes in the wild has decreased by nearly 40% since 1985. Giraffes have disappeared entirely from seven countries where they used to live. Researchers believe that fewer than 98,000 exist in the wild, fewer even than endangered African elephants. In 2016, the International Union for the Conservation of Nature added giraffes to the organization's red list of threatened species. What is causing their disappearance? Overpopulation of humans in giraffe habitats and illegal poaching. Learn about giraffes' physical characteristics, habitats, and life cycles. Examine the dangers they face from humans and climate change, and meet the scientists working to save these gentle giants using technology and conservation efforts. A fish that walks on land, a frog that makes its own sunscreen, and an insect that can become invisible? Whether to avoid predators, to stalk prey, or to withstand extreme temperatures, Earth's creatures have evolved some outrageous features and tricks to ensure survival. For example, did you know that the geoduck, nope, it's not a duck, it's a clam, can live for as long as 160 years? And that the eye, a nocturnal primate, uses echolocation and a long spindly finger to find and dig up food? Or that in its deep ocean habitat, the vampire squid uses bioluminescence to startle predators? These are among the many animals that show evolution and adaptation at work. And that's a wrap on our webinar. We hope you've discovered some fun new titles to add to your summer reading collections and support your activities for the CSLP Tales and Tales theme. If you have any further questions about the titles I've presented today, feel free to email me at rzugsworth at learnerbooks.com. 
You can also visit our website, learnerbooks.com slash go slash summer reading to browse these and other related titles on our website or to download the complete title list. Thank you for joining us today. And I hope you have a fabulous time with your summer reading program. Have a great day.